full of blood? I wonder what's made it so red. When deciding where our loyalties lie, we must consider the end. Ah. 
chaos and destroy those who oppose us.
you did to my family. Ella. approaches. Are you ready for honor? For glory? For certain death? I'm ready for two-thirds of that. Then you see combat with the Minotaur! The Minotaur's already dead. By my hand. You killed the Minotaur? <laughs> I'm, I'm sorry, friend. You're very mistaken. Some scam artists fooled you with flame-lit corridors and flimsy costumes. The 100% genuine and completely real Minotaur lives here. <laughs> and uh, you better believe it. If you slay the Minotaur, you would be Theseus reborn. And you'd get to take home the prize of Pepka! Your Minotaur must die. Sounds like we have... Another contender! It's time for the trials of the Minotaur! Three trials. Did you just say Minotaur pre-trials? To face the Minotaur, you must first prove yourself worthy by completing three heroic trials. We can't let people fresh off their Teremis casually stroll to their deaths. Pepka policy. Tell me about your Minotaur. Part man, part beast, all monster. His horns are as sharp as blades. His blades are as sharp as... 
Horns? Wait, uh, no, I, I always mess that up. A vivid portrait? You must have seen him personally. Many times. And I'll tell you this much. No one's ever returned from where he dwells. I'll do your trials. Pre-trials! I'll do your pre-trials. But then the Minotaur's head is mine. Fantastic! Don't forget to collect tokens of success from the trial masters to prove your victories. Ugh, another champion here to save us all from Pefka's long queues and overpriced Minotaur merchandise. Ah, may I introduce my wife, Cory? A rare beauty and so... so loud in front of my new friend. <laughs> Please, Leandros, there are more important things than glory. Not everyone with a sword seeks glory. Family comes before all else. Exactly, Mystios. That's what I keep telling this cowardly slime in the shape of my husband. Hey! It's... It's our daughter. Your daughter? Amara. She ran off days ago. I'm sure she's... She's just fine. Don't worry about Amara. Not when there's a Minotaur to slay. Grrr! Slash! Slash! Big fight! Lots of blood! Think of the fame, Mystios. Think of winning the prize of Befka! Please, trust me, Siantion. Nothing is what it seems in Befka. Solving one problem may just solve all the others. Go, my legendary friend. The pre-trials of the Minotaur await. Maximum of three members per Minotaur hunting party. Who is Enough. Maximum of three members per Minotaur hunting party. No legendary warriors, friendly heroes, or legitimate gods. Challenger, you are here to have your feeble frame crushed in my pre-trial of strength, yes? My feeble frame might be harder to crush than you think. <laughs> so brave, pretending you have a chance against a warrior as strong and handsome as me. We may fight for my token, yes, but maybe you would prefer to remain uncrushed and buy my token instead, yes? No. We fight. Are you sure you would not prefer to spend your shiny drachmi? We fight. Then let the crushing begin. You should have bought my token, yes? <laughs> What am I feeling? What is this? The shame of defeat. This is defeat? Winning is better. Yes, the token of strength is yours. Have a wonderful day and please don't hit me again. I need all of the trial tokens. Stay 
away, potential champion. I warn you, pay to pass this trial, potential champion. The trial of endurance has seen more deaths than all the other trials combined. Were the others drunk when they jumped? Actually, yes. Very unprofessional of them. Should you survive the champion's dive, you'll need to retrieve my trial token from a chest in the darkest depths of the water below. Your token will be mine. No, please, I urge you, pay me for my token. The watery dangers you must otherwise face to retrieve it are too great. You won't get one drachmi from me. I'll do the trial. <sighs> If an excruciating underwater death is what you desire, who am I to stop you? Remember, you'll find my token in a chest at the bottom of the lake. I'll be waiting for you at the water's edge in the extremely unlikely event you survive. How exactly does going for a swim test my ability to slay the Minotaur? Minotaurs work in mysterious ways. Seems like a lot of hassle for a token. Looks like I'll have to get wet. Don't lose your token, champion. But if you do, I can give you a Why the hell? What trouble have they gotten into now? Their mother's going to feed me to that damned Minotaur. This must be the pre-trial of accuracy. Hmm? Oh, yes. This is the pre-trial of accurately finding my Malaka's sons. Your sons? This doesn't sound like a trial. Have you tried raising sons? It's perhaps the greatest trial of all. Only by completing the world famous and totally legitimate pre-trial of accurately finding my sons can you proceed and face the Minotaur. So, if I find your sons and make sure they're safe, you'll give me your trial token? You'll get my token and my eternal gratitude. I'll find your sons, pull them out of whatever trouble they've stumbled into. They usually hide in the fields behind me. May I suggest you prepare yourself mentally and physically. This will be your greatest trial yet, brave warrior. Don't worry, I'll make... You must find all three of them. And hurry, 
there's only so long my wife will believe they're off praying at the temple. Found him. There he is. I see him. to your father and do as he says, or I'll tell the Minotaur where you live. But! Uh, I hate you, Mistios! Help, please! Help me! I'm trapped up here! You're safe. Go home. And listen to your father when he calls for you. Yes, miss. Sorry, miss. Everything you broke was really expensive. So, my pattern will probably kill you. I'm sure. Home. Now. <sighs> and that's the last of the sons. You brought them home! You were right. They are little shits. Mm. I can't believe they listened to you. Consider the trial of accurately finding my sons complete! Of all my victories, this is the one I'll be most remembered for. That's all three tokens. Better meet Leandros at the warrior's rest. Please, just come down!
don't have to do this. There's always something to live for. No, not for me. I've got nothing. I am nothing. This isn't even armor. It's my mother's third favorite serving tray. I'm a failure. A failure! You look like a warrior to me. Even warriors feel fear. There's no shame in it. Fear helps us survive. It's temporary, but honor is not. You'll find no honor jumping off this building. Only death. Talk to me. Honor. Yes. My village. <laughs> We're poor. We get little trade. Fewer visitors. We're dying. I was chosen to kill the Minotaur, hoping it would make us famous. Put us on the map. Save us, maybe. But look at me. I'm no Minotaur slayer. I got robbed by a tiny tour guide my first day here. The Minotaur is already dead. I killed it. You? No. I was supposed to do it. Sorry. Then my people are doomed. Minotaur slaying isn't for everyone. Even if you go home without the beast's head, there will be another way to save your village. You're right! All I have to do is... lie to everyone! Do not put words in my mouth. Why not? They're good words. My people are kind and loving and... somewhat dim. Really? Hard to believe. I just have to make them think I've killed the Minotaur. Our village will become a shrine to me. The new Theseus, Mori is the Magnificent, Slayer of the Minotaur. We would prosper again. Sounds like a dream. A dream where people care about my village, trade with it. That's a dream worth having. A little look convincing. Like a regal, conquering Minotaur killing hero. Best steal the Pefka leader's shiniest armor. Oh, and a leader weapon. Something I can say I pride from the Minotaur's cold dead hands. <laughs> Cold dead hoofs? Don't worry. I'm here to help. Good. 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 Is there anything else I can tell you? I've heard enough. I'll find you an axe and armor worthy of a true Minotaur Slayer. Just don't jump. I wouldn't think of it. The armor Maurice described. It is shiny.
ask the man from the roof wanted. It's pretty heavy. I wonder if he could even lift it. Now I have both items the man on the roof needs to bring glory back to his village. I better get this back to him before he actually jumps. I'm back. And I have everything you need to successfully lie to your people. Oh, fantastic! And fear not, friend. This is a lie that will save my people. It will put us back on the map. Well, um, can I, uh, can I have my items now, please? Of course. The axe and the armor are yours. Just uh, turn around for a second while I change. You look heroic, like a warrior who could kill a whole family of minotaurs. Really? You're not just saying that. No, I mean it. Even I'm a bit intimidated by you now. Wow! It's okay, guys! I'm a hero now! I'm coming down! I feel pretty heroic. And our world famous Minotaur tunics! Tunics! Minotaur tunics! One size fits all. Uh, I don't see how one size can fit everyone. My name's Arsenios. If you want to know how to defeat the Minotaur and become the Greek world's most famous warrior, then this is the tour for you. Don't need the tour. You already killed the beast. You think you. <laughs> Epic battle. Lots of blood. An epic battle with a man in a mask? You were scammed, warrior. But have no fear. You're in Pefka now. A land famous for its honesty and total lack of scams. You sell it well, kid. Let's go on your tour. You're not worried someone's going to steal your world-famous Minotaur tunics? Who would? Our tunics for Minotaurs. As you can see from the statues, the Minotaurs are fierce of both. 
So don't forget this exclusive tour team. He hates being stabbed. Particularly the sharp objects. They say it's his only weakness. Be <laughs> Marto! <laughs> Exact replica of the Minotaur. Actual Minotaur size may vary. Where's the rest of him? Up the hill. Some of the workers lost control moving into the place. It killed two of them. Horn stored them clean apart. Well, not clean apart. Sounds like even Minotaur statues are deadly. Oh, they're the deadliest. They say the sales himself was killed by a Minotaur statue. I've heard many tales of the Minotaur. They usually make the sales sound more heroic. Well, Sparta's not known for its quality education, is it? Next thing you tell me Medusa's real? She was, until I killed... <laughs> She's a mythical creature. <laughs> like, um, like a Cyclops. Cyclopses are real, too. I've killed... <laughs> Let's just continue the tour. Hey, in Pefka, the hero's always right. This way. Look out! That rock's actually a minotaur dropping. He must have just been through here. I can't believe we missed him. Here's another helpful tip you won't get on any other tour. The minotaur sells. Is it the morning person? Trust me, I know my Minotaurs. Sure, like I've been minotaur. in this business 27 years. Warriors from all over the Aegean come to Pefka to face the mighty Minotaur, hoping to claim his head as the ultimate prize. So far, well... <clears throat> he's killed all of them, but drinking freshly squeezed Minotaur hoofy leaks here will no doubt give you the oomph you need to triumph. And let me guess, you've got a vial, ready for purchase. It's just like Pether always said, never leave home without the ground-up hooves of a mythical creature. You never know when you'll need some minotaur hoof elixir. You've made a wise purchase, my physically responsible friend. Now come, there's so much more to see. I'm not saying I'm responsible for breaking the Minotaur statue, but I'm also not saying I'm not responsible. And so concludes our tour. That's the tour? I didn't learn anything about the Minotaur. My customers are always satisfied. You can pay my associates on your way out. Please enjoy the rest of your stay here in Pefka. You're not going to get one drachmi out of me. No! Not one! I'm getting all of it! Get her! Don't damage her kid! Someone named Melite, a man with influence and an obsession with masks. Never heard the name, but there's a man in town, Leandros. He knows everyone. I bet he can help you. Leandros? He's of no use to me. Hey! Yeah? What's it like being a Mystios? <laughs> Could be worse.
I have your Malaikas tokens. No more games, no more schemes to rob me of my Drachmi. It's time to slay our Minotaur! Absolutely, Mistios. Uh, no problem. But first, perhaps you'd like to buy back your exquisite, uh, finely crafted trial tokens? This offer will expire in... Uh, By the gods! They uh, make for fantastic gifts. Strange. But I would like something to remember Pefka by. And all that's left is facing our star attraction himself, the Minotaur! Are you ready to meet your doom? If your pre-trials are anything to go by, yes, yes I am. Well, good! Great! I, I, I want you to fight the Minotaur! You'll find the beast in the depths of the Cave of the Bread, on the Ditsky Plateau. Two other warriors have just completed their pre-trials. You can speak to them for more information. They'll join you when you're ready to, you know, die horrifically. You've come all this way. Join us. <laughs> no, 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 no. I have a very important uh, pottery lesson to attend. So... <clears throat> final member of our Minotaur hunting party has arrived! When the beast sees our assembled might, he will moo miserably in fear! Do Minotaurs moo, or...? If it's all right with both of you, I'd like to strike the killing blow. Or can we at least say I struck the killing blow? I'm willing to haggle down to play the key role in distracting the Minotaur while allowing the killing blow to be struck. The killing blow will go to the warrior with the greatest skill and courage in battle. Then I shall wear the Minotaur's entrails as my necklace. <sighs> this can only end well. Are you ready to ride? Let's slay a Minotaur. Leandro says it lives in the Cave of the Brave on the Victi Plateau. I say let the Minotaur tournament begin! If the Minotaur eats humans and lives right next to the population of Pefka, how are they all still alive? Perhaps the diet of Pefka disagrees with you. Good thinking, brother. Let us dip our blades in rich oils and onions to gain an edge in combat. Whoever lives down here must be a monster. Malaga, 
I'm going to start stabbing until someone tells me what's going on. Minotaur I killed talked less. Killed? No, uh, we don't have to use the, the K word. I mean, grrr. there's no need for more blood. Just keep your horns away from me and tell me what's going on here. You can take off that mask. Leandros? I told you nothing is what it seems in Fafka. I'm... Uh, happy to refund any expenses incurred. Please. It's my daughter, uh, Mara. Masked men are holding her captive deep in the canyons of Fifi Plateau. Masked men? What kind of masks? Uh, uh... White like marble. Bleeding from their eyes. Horrific! The cult. They control everything in Pefka. Lured champions from all over with the promise of Minotaur slaying glory. Only to swindle and ambush them down here in the dark? Honorless. If I don't do as they say, uh, Amara dies. If I take off my mask, or tell my wife, or ask for help, she dies. How many men have you sent to their deaths with a speech and a smile? Thousands. More. But their lives will never outweigh my Amara. She's all I have. But now I have you, don't I? You. You can free her from those Malakas masked men. Tell me, whose face would Amara wish to see rescue her? Mine? Or her father's? Be brave, Leandros. Bravery, yes. You're right, Mistios. No matter what, I must be there for my Amara. Please, will you join me? We will save your daughter. Together. Thank you, Mistios. Meet me outside the ruins of Zakros on Vitki Plateau. That's where my daughter is and where I must be. These masked men, they're organized and unafraid. Their greatest weapon is no blade, it's our plea. Every merchant, every man and his slave are enough to crack me out of this charade to make Midas blush. The myth of the Minotaur makes us all rich, and we turn a blind eye to the ghost. Gah! Why is this suit chafing? I used a whole bottle of olive oil. Hard to breathe in a costume this magnificent. By Zeus, this fair doesn't breathe at all. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. You are the Minotaur. No, 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 the last one was better. I'm coming, Amara. Don't be afraid. And don't you be afraid, Leandros. She needs you. Stand with you, Leandros. No matter what happens today, Amara will be proud of her father. I see you're still a Minotaur. I faced many of the Greek world's deadliest warriors in this mask. Granted, I was just there to distract those warriors with my roars and threatening gestures so they could be ambushed and stabbed from behind. But wearing it makes me feel brave. And you look it. It would be an honor to fight alongside the mythical Minotaur. Yes, yes! Move! Don't do that. They must be keeping her underground. With hooves and heroics. We shall save her! But Zakros is well defended. How should we proceed? Quietly. I'll try to sneak in. Stay back here until it's safe. I can be stealthy! You have horns. <sighs> 
go. I'll do my best to distract the guards. Where is your honor, you best Malakis? The Minotaur calls you. Come and face me. Show me your bravery by leaving the safety of your friends. and waited and you weren't going to leave me here were you you were just working on your plan to save me right pater of course i was always coming for you i just needed to find something first the people who took you if there's anything you overheard anything that could help me stop them while i pretended to sleep their leader spoke at a meeting place in kidonia i wrote down all the masked men's whisperings hopefully something in here will be useful to you my friend, we're heading to my wife. She keeps a vigil for Amara at the warrior's rest. Come with us. See the gift you gave. Our family, together. After you. Amara! Amara! You're alive! Mater! My family, you did this? Thank Leandros. When the time came for action, he charged. Despite being outskilled and outcostumed, he fought courageously. Your husband is no coward. Perhaps there are some heroes here. No one's ever won the prize of Pekka! Everyone! 
everyone who's died facing the Minotaur has had their drachni go in the vault, growing year by year. And now, a tiny but well-earned portion of it is yours. Thank you for a... a tiny portion? Of course. Less taxes, reasonable operational expenses, and I'll make sure all of it reaches your boat, Mistyos. You've earned it. <laughs> oh, and... Hmm, this is for you. A coward doesn't deserve to be the Minotaur. You do. Quite a compliment. Befka is no longer safe for us. Freeing Amara will bring repercussions from people who are not known to be forgiving. But we're alive. And whatever future we have, we have it only because of you. Be safe. existed for decades and will exist for centuries more. Cult of Cosmos will burn the old world to ashes and build a new. seen it yourself. The future belongs to us now. Old gods and new be praised.
Sandra, it was never supposed to be like this. Decades ago, a group of people gathered together to uphold a theory which they believed could control the universe. That the world functioned in equal parts, order and disorder. But some fell lovingly into the wicked arms of chaos, and the cult of Cosmos was born. They abused their power, casting the Greek world into eternal war, one you were created to stop. In destroying the cult, you have done what I could not. You are a hero, but this imbalance comes with a price, my child. For without chaos, there is supreme order, a loss of progression and freedom. But there is still hope. Hope in you. Hope in the future you will bring. We must fix the mistakes of the past. Use the staff. Repair the rift in the universe. The world depends on you, Cassandra. You need to be the hero again. So, you've seen it too then. It's beautiful, isn't it? What are you doing here? You killed the last member of the cult. Well, just about. What? It's true. I was their leader. But only for a moment, it seemed. When your brother came along, it changed everything we were aiming for. You agreed with them? The fucking cult? The powers that be in the Greek world weren't doing things the right way. The cult just wanted a clean slate. By way of corruption! Dirty drachmi! They killed people in a war they made themselves! Fueling war was one of the methods, yes. But it was controlled. Until suddenly it wasn't. And then I didn't like what we were doing anymore. I thought Vimos was on your side. Not in the way we hoped. As you know, he's impossible to control. He worked his way to the helm, and then he held even more sway than I did. Malaka! So you were after us! Not you, your bloodline. People like Leonidas, like you, have always posed a threat. Then we met and you surprised me. You were nothing like Demos. Why not just use me? I was in the palm of your hand. You made me optimistic that you could help me bring down the cult that had become so corrupt. And you did. 
Albeit unknowingly. You're all the same. Selfish and fucking destructive. It was different in the beginning. It wasn't about destruction. It was about redirection. I just don't understand. What about this pyramid? How does it work? Why does the cult have it? I've been trying to figure out all of that myself. It's as much of a mystery to you as it is to me. This pyramid has been worshipped by the cult for decades. And we have used it to replace the Oracle of Delphi, the most trusted person in all the Greek world. Using the people's reliance on a pantheon of dead gods would help to reshape humanity in our favor. The pyramid holds a mysterious power to see into time. But only certain people can activate it. People like Vimos and the ones in your bloodline. But you've seen something too. I don't know how or why, but it did show me something. What did you see? I saw you. In the vision, you destroyed the pyramid and you destroyed the cult. I saw what would come after. After the cult? We will be replaced by a new kind of order. Control under the reign of a philosopher king. There will be a movement away from the old gods toward rational society. Built in a kingdom by the people, for the people. And I must find someone to lead them. But I couldn't achieve any of this with the cult and their chaotic regime. So I let them carry out their plans and let the time of the cult of Cosmos come to an end on its own. Wait. Did Pericles know? I wanted to protect him, so I kept him in the dark. He would have had his own opinions, but he was never supposed to die. That is the truth. He trusted you, and in the end you didn't protect him. Maybe he would be alive if you'd stopped them. Gods know I would have if I could. When Vimos killed him, I knew the original cause was lost. I had to retreat. So, what happens now? We shift focus. We steer towards a new republic under one supreme rule. A dream I'll make a reality. But it is still a dream. One that isn't realistic. Abandon what you know and just imagine. Forget democracy. No more blue and red. Just citizens working for a greater good. This is crazy. It won't work, Aspasia. It didn't work. It's not crazy. It's enlightened. Once people in Athens get wind of this, they'll come to know they've wanted it all along. Even you. <sighs> I'm not sure. You've spent your whole life thinking for yourself. Let go. What I plan will require you to trust me. Come with me. This future's not a dream. I can't let you do this. You've caused so much damage. You destroyed the Greek world. You've proven you have no understanding of what we're doing. I misjudged you. So did I. Storm. <laughs> 